Hello everyone, my name is Chen Xin, and this is the Voodoo Control. The Voodoo Control is a full-featured remote control and photo focus for the Blackmagic Pocket Cinema Camera 4K and 6K. We did this on our spare time in the past 4 to 5 months, and we are planning to launch a Kickstarter campaign, hopefully by the end of the month. Before that, I'd like to show you a teaser video of how the prototype works so far. Here I have a Blackmagic Pocket Cinema Camera 4K set up with a Panasonic 12 to 35 lens on it. Okay, I am turning this on, and you can see we have all the camera infos updated to the Voodoo Control. Let's start with the focus feature. As you can see, how responsive the camera is to my rotation. And the screen on the Voodoo Control also shows which focus direction that I'm rotating to. Now if I press and hold this for 2 seconds and release, we can adjust the focus throw. The higher the number is, the shorter the focus throw will be. We implemented this adjustment feature because every lens has a different responsiveness to the rotation. I just set it to 12x to crank up the sensitivity just to show you. It's getting jumpy for this lens, but it could be useful for lens with very long focus throw. Every lens have a different sweet spot. This is the ISO control. As you can see again, this is buttery smooth. Alright, let's be quick. This is the iris or aperture adjustment. And this is how you adjust the shutter angle. Um, of course, you can set the shutter speed if the camera is set to shutter speed. And now we're working on switching to shutter on the boot control. I don't think I need to zoom in on this one. Obviously, you can tell it's adjusting the white balance. Okay, now we switch to mode 1. We were in mode 0. Now I'm gonna adjust the frame rate. For frame rate, I can adjust both the project frame rate and the clip frame rate. Now I press and hold to switch to the clip frame rate. And now we are adjusting. This is the peaking, I hope you can see it. And we here we have the zebra setting. I forgot to switch on the zebra, um, but it works. <laughs> and here we have a very dangerous feature, the color bar. I think we might end up removing this feature because accidentally if you activate it, it's gonna lock the machine for 4 seconds. Oh, I think I forgot to mention, of course, it works with the recording and stop. Rack, stop, and follow focus will always work in all three modes. Now we switch to mode 2, which is the playback mode. We record something, and uh, meanwhile, it's still focusing. So we stop, and then we can playback. In this mode, you can enter the replay mode, you can switch the previous and next, li next clip and also you can uh, get back to the standby mode. As I said, the focus and rack stop will always work in all the modes. Anytime you can just press the knob and get back to the focus mode. And the follow focus not only works with micro four thirds lens, it also works with most EF lenses adapted through the Metabone Speed Booster. I have a Sigma 18-35 1.8 lens here. We've tested quite a few Canon lenses and it all works fine. You just need to adjust the focus throw to find a sweet spot. But we cannot guarantee of course that all EF lenses will work. Alright, that's everything I'd like to show you about the Voodoo Control prototype so far. I hope you like the Voodoo Control, and if you have any more questions, please leave it down in the comment section below. And meanwhile, please please help us to share the message out to other people who might be interested in the control. Because uh, this is a very niche product, um, we know this is not going to like sell a lot. So we need more people's help to make the actual production possible. By having enough uh, interests, we can talk to the manufacturers to get an estimated best price 
and to bring the uh, per unit price down to make it more affordable. So please help us to share the message out. And meanwhile, uh, lastly, um, if you haven't yet, please do sign up for the for the email updates on our website. We will send up major progress reports and also uh, the early early bird deals on the e uh, on the Kickstarter campaign through the emails. Okay, uh, that's it for the video. I hope you enjoyed it, and thank you. I hope to see you soon in the Kickstarter campaign video. Bye bye. Jeez, I look so nervous on the screen when I'm speaking English. Well, whatever. Hope this video has been more or less helpful.